Today, some children in the Springs got their first taste of freedom thanks to a special event held at the Air Force Academy Youth Center. The Resource Exchange hosted an, an adaptive car building event for toddlers called Go Baby Go. It provided free mini motorized cars for families with children with developmental delays who cannot walk unassisted. Now, the cars increase developmental growth and future learning opportunities for children who receive them. Governor Jared Polis is intervening in the dispute between Altitude and Comcast and Dish. The governor tweeted a picture today of an open letter that he sent to the network saying, quote, Coloradans love our professional sports teams and we miss seeing them on TV at home. He said the standoff between the networks and the providers has gone on for too long. The dispute over retransmission fees has been ongoing since late August when talks between the two groups collapsed. Altitude announced an agreement with DirecTV at the end of December. Happening now, the longest running women's film festival in North America is back for another year. The 32nd annual Rocky Mountain Women's Film Festival runs through tomorrow at Colorado College. It honors filmmakers and films that celebrate the drive, spirit and diversity of women. And organizers say that while not all of the films are directed by women, they also they all do support the festival's mission. This is really an opportunity for people.